Can receiving a thank you note cause cascades of appreciation? And what does that mean for the future of Wikipedia? I'm Nathan Matias, an assistant professor in communication at Cornell, where I lead the Citizens and Technology Lab. Hi, I'm Rhi Wilkeshev. I'm Julia Kamen, research director at the Citizen and Technology Lab. Hi, I'm Max Klein. Hi, I'm Eric Pennington. Research on expressions of gratitude emphasizes their role to bind together social bonds of direct reciprocity. You receive a benefit from someone and you partially pay it back through the feeling and behaviors of gratitude. But scientists have long puzzled over whether gratitude can spread across a growing network or whether it stays within reciprocal bonds of obligation. When Wikipedia created a feature for thanking people for their contributions to knowledge, they hoped to encourage a welcoming culture and also provide a way to encourage contributors to keep volunteering. Past studies have found that visible public rewards can increase how much people volunteer by increasing reputation. But thanks messages aren't so public and Wikipedia isn't a system where people exchange favors in bonds of direct reciprocity. It's a system of generalized knowledge with indirect reciprocity, where people contribute to a common good and expect to receive benefits from those who are different from the ones they help. If expressions of thanks are mainly a way to sustain direct reciprocity, the act of thanking someone on Wikipedia might not influence behavior or contribute to a wider culture of appreciation. By studying this question, we can test practical questions for Wikipedians while unlocking new knowledge about the diffusion of gratitude in society. How can we study this question? At the Citizens and Technology Lab, we work alongside communities to advance theory and practice by testing ideas for social change online. In this field experiment, funded by the Templeton World Charity Foundation, we collaborated with the Persian, Arabic, Polish, and German language Wikipedias to test the effects of receiving thanks. CatLab includes communities in every stage of the process, working with our community liaisons to define research goals and study procedures, review ethics, pre-register hypotheses, implement studies, and interpret our findings. We also used this study to extend our field experiment software to Wikipedia. Here's one area where this process shaped our study design. While other experiments on Wikipedia have used automation to deliver interventions, communities argued that automated thank you notes don't really have the same meanings as thanks from a person. They also argued that the study should only include people whose contributions merited thanks. So using models trained and defined by communities, we identified thank-worthy edits and included participants in an intent to treat study where we encouraged hundreds of volunteers to thank randomly assigned eligible participants. The total study, which ran from August 2019 into February 2020, included over 15,000 newcomers and experienced Wikipedia accounts across four language Wikipedias. Among several outcome variables, we looked at the effect on how long someone continued to contribute to Wikipedia and the incidence rate of thanks they sent in the 42 days after receiving the intervention. In the control group, 16% of newcomers and 38% of experience accounts were still editing Wikipedia two weeks later. And experienced accounts sent a much higher rate of thanks than newcomers. On average, across all languages, we found that simply being assigned to receive thanks increased two-week retention of Wikipedia contributors by two percentage points whether a person was thanked by volunteers or not, with the largest effects occurring in communities with the lowest retention rates. Even more surprisingly, while prior research on gratitude has emphasized its role in reinforcing direct reciprocity, we find evidence that thanking someone can cause cascades of appreciation. Across newcomers and experienced accounts alike, uh, those assigned to receive thanks uh, had an increase in the thanks they sent by 1.6 times on average, and over 99% of those second order thanks are sent to a third person. For Wikipedias, this is good news. 
thanking someone on Wikipedia can increase contributor retention, especially among newcomers and in contexts where retention rates are low. Even better, thanking someone can cause a cascade of appreciation, increasing the chance that the recipient will go on to thank someone else. In science, field experiments often establish facts about the world that theory then adjusts to explain. We find that in generalized exchange across multiple cultures, receiving thanks causes people to thank others and that the outward facing structure of these cascades may help explain how gratitude expressions encourage and sustain public goods. This study also validates our process and software for community-led experiments on Wikipedia across multiple languages. This spring, CatLab received new grant funding to grow our work with Wikipedia communities and grow our circle of scientific collaborators. So if you're interested to do similar collaborative experiments, do reach out. Thanks.